you've been in the restaurant industry for a while. I'm sure you've seen it all. Why do, why do activist investors like, obviously you haven't been to target this, your stock has been, has been up significantly. Why do they target the restaurant sector? And have you, put, have you talked about this with your team on how to keep them at bay? You know, we have the Buffalo Wild Wings vote today, shareholder vote. How do you keep them, these guys off? Well, uh, uh, several things. I mean, uh, I've, I've been involved on other boards with activist investors, and I think one of the a couple of things I say, you have to talk to them. Yeah. You have to listen to what people say. I mean, one of the things I think we're good at is listening to what investors say. We spend a lot of time going out talking to our investors, be they long investors or short investors. Um, we uh, constantly look at consumer data because I think the best way of staying ahead is to see what the consumer said. We've upped our ante actually on that. Uh, we keep innovating. But if I change your question slightly and say, why do people like our stock and why is it an all time high? I think it's simple, beautiful business model. We've got a management team that cares about investors. We've got, a, I think we're, I'll give Starbucks huge credit. I think they're a leader in digital, so are we. And I think besides us two, no one else is close. I'm putting the pizza people separate because that's a separate category that obviously I know something about. So I think it's great things. And if you want my view, we were at 58.42 yesterday. Our stock's undervalued. Yeah. 